About 15 years ago or so, I bought a new washer and dryer, new to me. Uh, I, it was used, but it was from a pretty reputable uh, appliance company in the Swedes. And uh, installed them at the house, and they worked wonderfully. And as you might know, washers and dryers wear out over the years. And the dryer started having some noise issues, and it uh, evidently went, made a bang when my roommate was doing laundry, so uh, uh, we determined, well, actually, she's the one that determined that it was probably the main bearing. All right, so uh, this is the part that we're trying to take out because we need to replace this uh, bearing shaft. And we had to look it up online. Actually, we do need to have something lift this up and hold it just right there. Oh, that, are you kidding me? What happened? Did it fall? No, the hole yeah. is too small to get this socket in there. Oh no. So the bearing replacement kit comes with four pieces and it's the shaft, the bearing, a retainer clip, and the outside sleeve. <clears throat> Oh yeah, easy peasy. <laughs> of course they say that. <laughs> yeah. You pay for the company to say it. <laughs> oh, I think that did it. Kinda. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> Okay, go ahead and let it go. Let's see. No, okay. Oops. Actually, let me have that. Okay. I'll go ahead and lift it up. My hand. <laughs> we are on a closed track. Okay, let it dry. <clears throat> mm. All right, I'm gonna stop for a bit. Okay. All right, so removing these screws, I think. The kit also comes with a set of replacement screws, and I realized that the screws were still in place, and I didn't really consider why the screws were still in place. I thought that Sonia had put them back in. Okay, so there's this back piece that fits on. Then there's this piece. So, and that goes on. I'm going to be useful. Hey, hey. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh. oh yeah, sorry. I thought it was a bug. No, it's a fan. Is that better? Actually, yeah, thank you. Sorry, no, I have a problem. This little one that I no, it's just put out. in my I, like, purse and stuff when I leave. That's cool. I had a, uh, I just had this vision of like a big honking bee or something. Oh yeah, it is a little weird because it's open like that. Mm -hmm. There's a number of times that I like on my computer. Well, of course, because you know it's you. Well, trying to, well, trying to close it even because that button is like the worst placement for the button. Okay, now this goes on this side. Is that in? No. It is. It's not aligned. But. That's the first part. And then we'll have to see if we can do the alignment. I'm gonna go to the 
flashlight. Okay. So I need to uh, I need to twist this in place to get it to align with the holes in the uh, in the back. Right there. I'm sure there is an easier way to do this than an appliance repairman would just be laughing their socks off at me right now. It's like trying to put together a puzzle. Mm -hmm. Are you okay? Yep. Oh. No, we gotta replace that. Oh, do we? Yeah, take a look at it. Yeah. All those scratches there. Oh god, yeah, I see. Yeah. So. Okay. Okay. Well, that makes it a little more difficult. Okay, on to Plan B. Okay. All right, I'm going to try and see if this piece is separatable, and it is. Look at that. Well, she's had some wear. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that yeah. kind of makes there's sense. Some, uh, well, was, uh... There's some wear on there. That's <laughs> that's why it was so so attached. Okay, well, maybe will that make it? You think that's just a piece I need to replace then? I don't think that, I don't know if that piece even needs to be replaced. I just want to see if this will let that get in there. Please, baby, please, baby, 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 please. Come on. Uh, one of the things that we found that was so difficult was trying to get the dryer drum supported in the right place while doing all of this. And uh, it would be better if you ever have to do this to turn it on its side. So that this bearing is on the bottom. Try here again. Oh, and now this makes sense why you need to get your hand back here. Okay, now can you hold this up? Okay. A little bit higher. There we go. Okay, can I drop it or should I hold it? Yeah, that was worn. Oh, just a little bit, yeah. Okay. Can this drop or no? No. I didn't think, okay. I'm still holding it. Where? Where is it? I can't see where the... Oh, there it is. Okay, oh. There we go. <laughs> Ah, okay. Let go. Yeah. Yes. Oh. 
Thank you. You need that. Yeah. Oh, these shots. So we. So that was the hard part, right? Uh huh. Okay. I think. <laughs> Wait, so that looks like the part. So I think you can see that uh, those parts got a little worn. <laughs> <laughs> I decided to tip it on its side to make this easier to deal with. Uh, let's see, this one goes in like that. He's aligned. I think it goes in the other way. Yeah, okay. Huh. Uh, I just thought of something. If you can see, I've got these in. We had to tap this down with the hammer a little bit to get it so that it's more flush, but this is now in. These screws are holding down this spring, which is putting some little bit of tension on the bearing to keep it from wobbling. And then this is the cover that goes on. And if done properly, unlike what I'm doing. Click. And there we go, that's installed. Boy, that was a lot easier once we got what the parts were. <laughs> it's like, what are all these extra parts? How in the hell does this go together? All right. Well, at this point, we, uh, it was done, so we put it back together, and Sony was the one who took it apart first, so <laughs> she was the one kind of guiding how it went back together, but uh, <laughs> did a really good job. <laughs> Don't try this at home, we are professionals. <laughs> Okay, just to let you know what this sounds like with the new bearing in it. And that's because I've got it blowing straight out there, but... Um, so that sounds a whole lot better. So these are the pieces that are uh, remaining. <laughs> um, so this is the back piece that fit in that was holding the actual bearing itself. The bearing is, is gone. There was a bar, uh, bronze bushing that was in here. And this was part of this piece that was the outer spring part that held the uh, held the bearing in and of course this was the shaft <laughs> on which the bearing was riding which is not really much of a shaft anymore <laughs> yeah that's uh that's pretty well gone this is the cover that's still pretty good but you know here's some of the uh additional pieces so yeah that exploded good do it <laughs> i didn't do it this was not my fault <laughs> all right this wasn't the window. <laughs> no, but we got it done. 
Um, yes. And, and special thanks to Sonia for doing all the uh, all the front end work and getting that thing apart and looking at how it was supposed to go in. So cool, very cool. Thank you. No problem. Thank you for <laughs> helping with the rest of it. Yay! Yes, we did it.